now that I am here, I am very happy, but uh, sometimes when I remember, when I was there waiting for come here, I was a little upset because I was all the time being a waitress. And even now, sometimes I am dreaming that I am a waitress, but they are nightmares. Sometimes I, I am like uh, waking up like, why am I a waitress again? And it's, it's like so desperate. I don't want to have that nightmares anymore, but I am afraid that maybe when I finish here, I'm going to be a waitress again. I think it's a feeling that I can remove from myself. My name is Laura. Um, I am from Spain, from Ibiza, the island. And uh, I am 25 years old. And I am working as a European volunteer at August Global Media, that is a local TV and TV station. Well, um, when I finished my degree in Spain, I didn't find any job. And it was like difficult. And Spain right now is not in a super good situation to to find a qualification, a qualification job. So I saw that program about uh, European volunteers and I thought it was super interesting when I, when I finished my degree. And when I saw that project, the August Global Media, I thought it was very cool because um, I like it a lot because it's talking about uh, social integration, about social integration and cultural events. We covered that a lot. And I thought it was a very nice initiative. So I decided to come to that project in a specific, I didn't decide to come to Denmark. I mean, it was like Denmark, it was like with the project, so I came here. I really like to come to this park because uh, it makes me feel so relaxed. Because it's so green and there is so much water because there is the river and the lake also. And when I, my first time when I was here, um, <laughs> It was, I don't know, it was so beautiful. I, I didn't imagine uh, that country, it was going to be that nice. So sometimes when I feel like stressed for the work, because sometimes we are really in a hurry, I like to come here and only to bike or to walk. And it makes me so happy. The thing that I like the most is to live with the other European volunteers because I think it's very funny and you learn a lot about there. I am living with um, two Macedonian uh, guys and a Spanish girl and there is a French guy who is always at home. He's not living there. And I think you can see that we are different, but at the same time we get along and it's quite funny. But if you ask me about what is surprised me the most about maybe Denmark, I, I would say, uh, I would say the sea. I know it's a strange thing, but I am from an island and the sea here is like super quiet. It's not moving. It's so weird for me. I don't know, it surprised me when I saw the first time. It was like, why the sea is not moving? Uh, when I arrived here and I saw that everyone was on bike, I thought it was super cool. And I mean, now I had a bike too. And I think it's, it's amazing because all the streets are ready for to make it safe. Here you can, you can go by bike and it's super easy and it's super, I mean, it's cheap, it's safe, it's perfect. I am doing in that uh, uh, organization, like the journalist job, so my duty will be to looking for events or things that are happening and we think that they are important uh, for the community or like uh, we cover a lot of uh, cultural uh, events and social uh, integration events too. So. I have to look for that and later um, contact the people and later to make the arrangement with the cameramen and go there and make the edition. We uh, do as well like um, news for the different communities and later because in our company there are so many people from different places, um, everyone like talk about a subject related to something important for us. I think it's very important that we cover like social integration things, I think, I don't know, I, I feel like for me it's important. <laughs>